welcome back to my channel i finally did crochet again you guys i um have not done a crochet style in a good minute i think the last crochet i did were the faux locks and i kept those in for like two days or maybe i probably kept them in for a week but i didn't keep them in very long yeah so i did another style because i am i'm gonna be out of commission for like two weeks hopefully like only two weeks because i am having surgery so i uh i need a style that would just last so i could like remain cute and my recovery time will be lengthy so for the next month or two i won't be able to put out put out as many videos as i typically do just because i don't really know how like this whole recovery is gonna go for me so anyways let's go ahead and get into this hair i am wearing um the cuvana bounce hair this is from oh it's right behind me so this is from expression so it's the expression cubana bounce cubana cubana bounce hair um i have in the color two and i have in three and no, i have in three packs of hair three full packs of hair and i purchased four just to be on the safe side because one of my rules when it comes to crochet is always purchase one more pack than you need because you never know what is going to happen the hair is going to tangle and this and that and you're going to cut some hair out you're going to want to put some more hair in and all that other kind of stuff so yeah so this is the hair it definitely reminds me of jamaican bounce but this curl is definitely um a little bit looser than the jamaican bounce um, crochet that I really really like and it's a lot like it's a lot bigger as well I could have added a little bit more hair right here on the like at my part um, but I did it simply because you know you guys this hair is probably about to be pulled back like in a high pony with a cute little head wrap on my head for a few like weeks and um, at least another like maybe two weeks so i'll be rocking this hair i think you guys know me i could probably change my hair tomorrow so yeah so that's why i didn't really add i wasn't i only came on camera to look cute for you guys this is really about to be out my face and i just want to look decent just in case i do have to go anywhere or anyone comes over while i am down and i don't look like a like a like a slob so yeah another thing i did not i want to point out like right here on my edges because these two spots if you've been following me for a long time you go these two spots are just like my thin spots there's not really much i can do i have tried to do this that and the other and i still do um oil them with castor oil and massage daily but i just think that's just me and that's just my hair so those are my thin spots and so i try not to put any tension on them if i don't have to and the fact that this hair would be like on the side or i'd have a head wrap on i just didn't feel the need to like bring the crochet like all the way up on my edges when this big old hair would be covering it so that as far as cutting this hair i didn't really cut too much you guys know i can get really scissor happy when cutting this hair but i did not this time i did of course add a little bit of bang right here in the front so i think it's cute and I brought the length up just maybe a few inches or so, not too much. But yeah, this is some big hair. This is some full big hair. So if you don't like big hair, you're probably not gonna like this. I can definitely see this style for spring break. It's very easy um, to maintain. Most crochet styles are gonna be easy to maintain. Um, the only thing you do have to be careful about is the water, if you plan on getting in the water, um, and then your curls falling as well. So I get so many questions about um, is this hair like water friendly? Will my curls fall? And to me, the looser the curl like this, the more you can kind of expect the curl to fall. But I would still rock it if I was going on vacation because it's just cute. And our number one priority when going on vacation anyways is being cute. So yeah, <laughs> I do not put anything in like synthetic hair in my crochet hair. I know some people do on their YouTube channels. That's cool. If you find them, go for it. But I know I'm going to get the question. Do I put anything in my hair? No, I don't because I don't waste my good uh products that are meant for human hair on synthetic hair this is not real it's not gonna benefit it at all um in my opinion so i just don't even bother i don't care if something was a dollar 99 i'm not even spending my dollar 99 on it 
I am just going to let it be and go about my business. So yeah, I hope you guys like this. I just kind of wanted to give you some ideas for spring break since it's right around the corner. So yeah, you guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you have any questions, you know I will answer you. Just put them down below in the comment section. And I think that's about it, you guys. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.